Okay, so I just had a realization while I was doing my chanting. And so, like, God, at various points through time, and continues to do so, will incarnate on earth. So that he can have a particular experience, so he can come and do a particular thing. Um, and specifically on earth, what God gets to experience by coming here is compassion for us because we suffer so much. And so he gets to come and be compassionate and help us here on earth. And but God is completely independent from, you know, his pastimes here on earth, you know, the various incarnations he comes as, you know, when he, when he, when his body dies, you know, he's, you know, still, he's still God, like God is, he's separate and it's almost like, I'm trying to think of how to describe it. It's almost like he creates like another being out of himself to like come and live on earth through, but when that being perishes it doesn't really die it's just still part of god it just comes back into blah blah, blah. i won't get all into that because it's complicated anyway um so just had me thinking about like how like we are i was like thinking like oh man like this is almost sort of like a video game that made me think about right whenever god wants to he's just like oh i want to feel this i want to feel that so i'll go to this planet i'll go to this planet i'll go to this realm and i'll get and i'll experience you know this type of pastime or this type of emotion or whatever and then but he's like could just at any point just leave <laughs> just like leave okay bye and it made me thinking about how that's what it's like when we play video games we get to go into this little world that we created and we get to go around and have these experiences that we want to experience and feel these things we want to feel but at any point we could just like sign off and be like okay bye and then that video game world is just over in its own separate we're independent from that and <laughs> this is like, oh, that's sort of like, <laughs> that's like, okay, I, it's a very, very materialist and mundane way of, of putting this, but, but you know, um, it's an analogy, but I'm like, oh, this is sort of what God is experiencing. And then I'm thinking like, oh, like we really are your playthings, right? Like we're just here to entertain you. And you're coming and you're going, you're independent and blah, blah, blah. And um, what I also realized is like, oh, like we also chose to come here. Like we also came here because we wanted to like have a pastime. We wanted to like enjoy ourselves. We're like, oh, okay. I'm not going to, I'm not going to be with God eternally. No, I'm going to turn away from God. I, because I want to enjoy what I want instead of being God's servant. I'm going to, I want to be served. I want to enjoy. So I'm going to go to earth because <laughs> I'm going to go to earth or whatever other, you know, planet because I want to enjoy what I want. And um, without, you know, realizing that, you know, we're going to suffer <laughs> because um, whenever we are not focusing on being God's servant, there is suffering. Anyway, um, so that's why we're here. <laughs> that's why we're here. We've been here for a long time, being born over and over and over and over and over again. Um, many, many lives, many, many and, and, and innumerable creatures, right? Um, and, but I, we're still eternal. Our souls are eternal. And when these physical bodies die, we are still our eternal soul. And at any point, we could turn back to God and say, okay, I sign off now. I sign off of this game, this world, this planet, and I want to be your servant God. So any point we can make that choice and we could decide to turn back to God and serve God like we were originally supposed to be doing. Or we're like, mm, but I still want, I still want I, 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 me, 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 my desires, my wants. I want to enjoy. What about me? I want to rule. I want to be in control. I want to be God. And then that's why we, how we get born again here. <laughs> On earth with all the suffering. Um, and not with God where we're supposed to be. So...
I, <laughs> it's hilarious and it's not. Um, yeah, I think it's, I think it's sort of funny. You know, you can only laugh about the predicament that we find uh, ourselves in, but just the, the, just the fact that like you're watching this video, like should be, you know, enough to wake you up if you don't already, you know, if you're not already there, if you don't already realize the fact that like, we are not these bodies, we are eternal souls. Our eternal position is to serve God um, and to be with God in um, his transcendental realm. And if you didn't already know that, <laughs> now you know. Um, and gosh, I've done so much <laughs> soul searching. My, my whole life has really been searching to understand like who really is God, who really are we, like what's really going on here. And um, I would say that bhakti yoga, um, one of the limbs of yoga, um, has has illuminated all of that for me. It's it's all there. It's all there. It's all there. It is. It has the knowledge. It is the knowledge, and it is the way. So um, I don't know if you're interested. If any of this piques your interest, then um, you know, shoot me a message. I can send you some resources. I can connect you with like a community to like, you know, learn more, but, um, yeah, uh, yeah, I had a sort of a trippy moment <laughs> with my chanting. I feel like I came to so many realizations when I chant, um, and like, granted, I'm really, I'm really trying to focus. I'm really trying to focus on God when I'm chanting. I'm trying not to like think about other stuff. You're not supposed to be thinking about other stuff. You're supposed to be thinking about God. But in my process of thinking about God, then I feel like ideas start coming and God's communicating with me. And like, you know, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm ruminating and meditating on things that I've been learning, ruminating and meditating on God's pastimes. And then things start, you know, coming together and making sense. So, um, yeah, <laughs> to share this with y'all.